Hello, it's Randy Rolfe from Institute for Creative Solutions, sharing foundational concepts about vibrant health through natural living. And today I want to talk about biology. Uh, most of us took a biology course in high school, and I was wondering what has really happened to biology. Uh, today, it's mostly biochemistry. Chemistry has taken over biology, and it's a shame because we're looking at the workings at the cellular level as at the molecular level. And, and that's all very helpful, but we're forgetting that the body works as a whole. Everything affects everything. When you take a drug to lower your blood pressure, guess what? It affects a whole lot of other things. If you're eating a whole lot of added sugar without all the vitamins and minerals that are supposed to be with sweet foods, it affects everything in your body, not just your digestion, not just your microbiome, um, and not just your mood. So we need to talk about biology, all these systems we have that interact. Uh, things that go on in our bodies are controlled by the hormones, the nerves, and intercellular communication, and uh, actually our own thoughts. If we're thinking uh, very scary negative thoughts, we actually increase the acid in our body and the inflammation response because of the stress level to every cell in our body. So biology needs to be looked at as a whole. Just like when we look at the environment, we have to look at the whole system. It's, just, it's not just the carbon cycle or the water cycle uh, or the, the oxygen cycle. It's a system and a whole. And I think we're, we've lost a lot of that contextualization when we talk about health and nutrition. We need to think of the whole system working together. So let's get a little bit back to biology. Okay, look at the biochemistry, it's really important. But then look at the whole system, the biology, what is going to be the ultimate result for the health and well-being and longevity of the organism. And that's us. So thanks for listening.